Hey guys, this is Uncoordinated Vids with a tutorial explaining you how to make your iPod look sleek yet simple to use with a few apps from Cydia and a theme called Vivid. The first step you need to do is go to Cydia. Step 2. First, you should press the search button and then search for Vivid. Scroll down. It's right there. Vivid comes in different colors so you can choose what you want. Alright, now when you press on Vivid, in the top right corner, you should see a button that says install, but since I already installed it, it says modify for me. Step 3. If you haven't already, go and search for Winterboard and download it. You download it the same way you did the first time. Step 4. Now that you know how to download apps, go to Cydia and download these three apps. Apple Wallpaper, Boss Paper, and Categories. Step 5. Once you have downloaded all the apps, go into Winterboard. Once you've gotten into Winterboard, you should see all the stuff that you have downloaded. Now click on Vivid. You, it'll show up as a check mark once you have. Step 6. Now you're going to learn how to use categories, one of the apps that you are supposed to install. I made a special video for this, and I'll put a link around the iPod. Step 7. Okay, once you have installed categories, we're going to go to Boss Paper now. Wait a sec. Okay, once you found the boss paper icon, click on it. What boss paper does is enables you to have backgrounds on the back, uh, behind your icons on your home page. So, first enable boss paper right here. Okay, so for the next part, you can choose images. So, you know the app that we installed called Apple Wallpaper? you want to go into folders and you have a list of all your installed icons from Cydia now click on the one that says library themes 2009 apple wallpaper okay once have you do once you've done that it'll have that and you can add cool stuff like transitions slideshows and other options that are cool. I like to use transitions and I just check marked all of them. So once you have done that, press on your home screen button and it will uh it'll respring and then you'll have what is up right there. And it I set it to change every ten seconds, so we'll just wait for it to change like that and sometimes it does repeat but that's okay now you're done your iPod or iPhone should now look like this something like that okay some I have some apps that could be useful to you okay so one app is called quick scroll so when you like press on a page there's this scrolling icon that comes down and you can just scroll really easily there's like a really long thing that you want to read that's really helpful and another thing is um, an app called Backgrounder which enables you to say I want to press on here let me go find radio oops apps music and 
and Pandora Radio. Okay, so I've already enabled it for this app, but what it does is it enables you to play music on an, an app, and you just hold the home button for like two seconds, and it'll say background enabled. And if I just turn up the volume, so uh, when you press home, it still plays in the background. Thank you. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.